the local community radio act would open up the nation's airwaves to hundreds, potentially thousands of more low power community local radio stations. So people have come out from around the country to tell their Congress people that they're capable of running these radio stations, they want these radio stations, and we're here to strategize on how to pass this legislation to get these radio stations in the hands of the people. We want a community radio station so in Baltimore City so our communities can be united and we can get the word out and raise people's consciousness about human rights values. I work with the Media Mobilizing Project and with Radio Tlacuachi, which is the, right now the only Spanish language radio program in Philadelphia. And um, we're seeing that it's actually really important that we have this program because um, while mainstream, um, even newspapers are, are kind of falling off and losing funding and cutting staff, we have tons of people coming to us actually and wanting to be a part of our radio station and, um, and, and seeing it as a way to get information out to the community about what's going on with, with immigrants, with workers, with students, with um, the community in general. And it's a way for people who aren't really connected right now to start connecting with each other. We are able to broadcast our own ideas, our own beliefs, our own, our own spirit of the movement, what it means to us. I'm from Galton, in Mexico. And, um, I'm here because of, um, I thought this would be a great opportunity to help out the community of Gallup since it's a border town between two states and also uh, kind of a border town between all the Native American um, reservations out there like Navajo, Hopi, Ute, and Zuni. It's just like um, kind of like a cultural, cultural um, port where all these cultures and traditions intermix with each other. People power. People power. The point here is that we're trying to uh, promote these low power stations because they're very, very useful. Eh, el ejemplo de la Florida, eh, tenemos una radio local pública que en tiempos de huracanes ha, ha sido eh, muy importante para la, para la gente. Like in the example of South Florida and Immokalee, Florida, is that uh, with such a radio station it has been in times of a hurricane has been used to evacuate people. The giant robot symbolizes automation and the lifelessness that's already in the corporate media. And once this giant microphone uh, is busted open with smaller microphones like in Fantasia, then all the people will actually be able to have those microphones. And, you know, access to the airwaves. Access to the airwaves. Hey, I love radio, yeah. <laughs> we have so much in common. Power! 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 Power to the people! Power!